We're waking up to the mid 60s. I want to emphasize this would put us now about 15 degrees warmer than where we started yesterday. Yesterday was so nice in the morning. It was nice and crisp outside. 66 in Springfield, 65 Decatur, uh, right at that 62 degree mark. Champagne, a little bit cooler. East Central Illinois, you uh, saw those clear skies out there. We've had this to look outside to see so far in the capital city. This live look looks pretty nice. I will say that uh, almost a painting out there with those clouds. It, it always really captures uh, a nice scene when we get that sunshine reflecting off those clouds. But uh, the sun is what's going to be the problem today. We're warming up another 20 degrees from where we are right now, plus so upper 80s. That puts us above average for the first time this week, and then we'll start cooling off tonight. But it is a slow cool down again even hotter heading into tomorrow. Looking at our satellite radar right now, the uh, rain, not a problem. We thought we might see a couple of sprinkles last night, but nothing to show you. So we're zooming out. Nice wide view of the US. Uh, not much concern right now. It is quiet here. Back to our northwest. That will be our next chance for showers. That would be it. Watching this uh, little system down into the southern Gulf there, stretching into Florida. Uh, not expected to become a our first named storm of the season yet, but June is when hurricane season starts and it's going to last all the way until uh, December. So we got six months to, of uh, hurricane season. Of course, there could be some before or after that. But for now, not a extremely active Atlantic, but that could change. We'll keep an eye on the uh, hurricanes uh, throughout the year. Of course, not really a major impact for us. There have been some that have moved into Illinois, the remnants of which could help some drought concerns. We are starting to get a little dry here in central Illinois. That continues today. No big changes on the next weather maker. We see the real changes arrive on Thursday. Hot, muggy, humid conditions all day, upper 90s, and then finally some thunderstorm chances in the afternoon and evening. But these look pretty scattered. They're not going to last long. And then Friday we start drying out. So for tonight, our temperatures here even hotter than this morning, upper 60s, low 70s, leading us into an extremely hot, dangerously hot day tomorrow. Almost you can see here we're talking close to the triple digits with that heat index. So just know that it's going to be hot, muggy storms late in the evening. Probably your day to be inside and then we are much cooler, less humidity here. Good day Friday. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.